Welcome to the instructional video for the Pixel Mago Speedlight. Make sure the flash is powered off. Slide the cover down and open the battery compartment door. Install four AA batteries correctly with the right polarity, positive and negative. Make sure the camera is powered off. Insert the flash into the camera's hot shoe. Slide the lock lever to the right. Turn on the power of the camera. Then set the power switch to on. The flash head can swivel up and down 90 degrees and left and right 180 degrees, meeting your demand for exposure of a variety of angles. Gently press this button to fire a test flash at current settings. When the recycle time is done, the green light will change to red. Gently press the LED button to enable the LED lamp. The LED on icon will be displayed on the screen. Gently press the zoom button, then turn the dial to adjust the focal distance of the flash head. Turn it to the left end to enable auto zoom changes. Gently press the sync button. You can switch to first sync, second sync and high speed sync. Gently press the function button. You can change common functions. Set the keypad voice on or off. Set the LCD lighting time to off 5 seconds, 10 seconds or on all the time. Set the AF assist beam on or off. When the AF assist beam is opened, half press the shutter button under low light shooting environment. The AF assist beam will light up automatically. Set standby time to 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, 1 hour, 2 hours, or non-sleep mode. By setting the power switch to lock, you can disable the flashes button and dial operations. Use this to prevent the flash function settings from being accidentally changed after you set them. Gently press the mode button to switch flash to working mode, such as TTL full auto mode, M manual flash, or MULT stroboscopic flash mode. Under the TTL mode, press plus minus button and turn the dial. Now you can set the flash compensation. Repress plus minus button again to set FEB. The following three times firing will output in low, middle and high increments. Under M mode, press plus minus button and turn the dial to set the flash output from 1 over 128 to 1 over 1 in 1 over 3 increments. Under MULT mode, press the plus minus button and turn the dial. You can set the flash output from 1 over 128 to 1 over 4 in 1 over 3 increments. Gently press the MULT button and turn the dial. You can set stroboscopic flash times and frequency. Margo Wireless Flash can make the master unit of the camera control slave unit of off-camera via optical pulse. Long press the function button to enter into wireless flash mode. Long repress the function button again to exit wireless flash mode. Gently press the set button to set master and slave mode when the master icon lights up and turn the dial to set the flash as master mode or slave mode. Under slave mode, gently repress the set button again and turn the dial. You can set the slave unit as one group of A, B and C. When the channel icon lights up, Turn the dial. You can select from four channels. Master and all slave units should set on the same channel. Under master mode, press the set button. The group icon will light up. Turn the dial. When group mode is set as all groups, you can set the flash compensation or output of all flashes. When group mode is set as A, B, you can set the light ratio or output of A, B groups. When group mode is set as A, B, C, you can set the light ratio of A, B groups and the flash compensation of C group, or set the output of ABC groups independently. Press the set button. When the flash on off icon lights up, turn the dial to set whether the master unit will join in the exposure or not.
In order to enhance wireless flash performance and control distance, you are advised to use Margo Speedlight with the King Pro Flash Trigger. The above video is the Pixel Margo Speedlight Instruction Guide. Thank you for watching.